Darnell Smith, defensive tackle, junior. I was kind of a late bloomer compared to a lot of my other friends and teammates. I started in uh, eighth grade. Uh, my first dream was basketball. Um, and in middle school, in seventh grade, I got cut from the basketball team. And I was like, OK, now it's time to kind of change directions. And eighth grade is when I first started. Um, I actually was not a good player at all. It was kind of, it was kind of you know, hard to transition from basketball to football. But once I got to high school, I just kind of kept learning, had a very good coaching staff and a great high school. And I kind of picked up a, a lot. At the end of my junior year, kind of going to my senior year, um, that's when I really kind of took a leap forward um, and I, I could really see my strength, my speed um, was really developing and I was kind of ahead, to, I was ahead of a lot of other people in my age group and I could see that, I mean I didn't know which level, you know, how high I would be necessarily, but I knew I had the potential to play Division One. Winning the state championship as a sophomore, that was, that was a great feeling. Um, with the double overtime against Carmel, it was a long, a tough game. At that time, I was I was on junior varsity, but I dressed all varsity games. Played every now and then. It was just a great feeling to to win the, the state championship and, and to win it in that fashion. They were very down to earth, very humble. Um, no one seemed you know kind of big headed. Like they, they told me you know straight like it was. So I came in here focused and working hard. I would have an opportunity to play. It wasn't gonna be handed to me, and it was close to home as well. And the coaching staff was, was very like I said, it was blue collar, and I, I like that a lot. Oh, it's, it's a great feeling. After you win those games and you go cheer with the fans and singing that fight song, it, it, it's great. It's definitely a great feeling. Um, I think I've became a lot, you know, over the years, a lot better in my, my run, uh, stopping the run. Um, I'm trying to uh, keep developing my pass rush. It's kind of been a little inconsistent. So I've been staying after practice almost every day, just staying after with Nick Miles or Keenan Noll or some of those guys, just trying to work on my speed and keeping my feet moving and working on my hands so I can become a better pass rusher. I think it's just our, our, our mentality. We've known, you know, over the last few years since I've been here, the offense has kind of, you know, led the way for us. And we've, we've made plays here and there, but we've been kind of inconsistent. So we know this year we kind of came in, uh, we've gotten a lot stronger working with Coach Feely, a lot faster, and we, and we know that. And we believe in ourselves, we have confidence, and we just, we're going out there, we're just running to the ball as hard as we can. We have no superstars on the team, we're just 11 guys working hard as one, so.